Hey guys, Julie here with WRWDW, and today I wanna to talk about making Dole Whip at home. If you can't be in the parks, then maybe we can bring a little bit of the parks home to us, right? So, or we could make a huge mess in our kitchen because that's how that's, this is gonna play out. Yes, so my husband Kurt and I are gonna to attempt to make Dole Whip, and we're not exactly uh, the chef types. Yeah, keyword was attempt. So I picked some of the easiest recipes uh, and we're gonna try two of them today to see what we can do if we can recreate some Dole Whip to have at home. So you ready to All get right. started? Yeah, what's the plan here? Okay, so the first one we're gonna do is pretty simple. Um, it's just frozen pineapple. So we just have a can of crushed pineapple. I placed it in the freezer for a few hours, so it's mostly frozen. I did a little bit of research before this and it seems like you want it mostly frozen but not completely frozen. I don't, I don't know why that is. So you don't destroy your blender. But you can put ice cubes in a blender. What kind of amazing blender do you have? A regular blender. Okay, get on with it then. Okay. Show me this magic. So, uh, crushed pineapple, so just canned crushed pineapple, uh, coconut milk, sugar, um, and a little bit of lime juice, and a pinch of salt. So, are you ready? All right, do it. Okay, so let's blend up some pineapple and see what we can do. All right, so why don't you add the pineapple. So this is two cups of cr canned crushed pineapple that I stuck in the freezer. Yeah. For, oh my God, okay. That I stuck in the freezer for a few hours. All right, a third cup of coconut milk. I see you bought light coconut milk. You know, it really saves some calories on your pineapple sugar disaster. So I don't disaster. know anything about coconut milk and I have no idea if light coconut milk will make a difference, so. I'm sure it will. <laughs> The recipe it's says called ice you, cream, not ice diet. <laughs> the recipe says you can sub regular milk instead, but coconut milk is so different. Okay, so three tablespoons of sugar. So it's just regular granulated sugar. Um, we're gonna do a little bit of lime juice. So a teaspoon of lime juice and just a pinch of salt. What's a pinch of salt? What do you consider? A, is that it, really? Yes. Does that do anything? Will that do anything? I That's feel a like pinch of salt. Not, is that a pinch? You just want to load this up with salt? I don't want to load You know when you start salt. changing the recipe is where but things go wrong. I don't wrong. think that's a pinch. Is do you, a pinch? Do you want more? How much salt would you like in this? I don't know. No, no, okay, okay, no, no, it's, <laughs> it's fine. Gonna have salty okay. ice cream. And then we're gonna blend. So, here we go. Should I liquefy this baby? Okay, that is, that is not the color of Dole Whip. That's a concerning color. It's that not. That looks like banana. It does look like banana. Isn't that also awfully chunky? Should I blend it some more? Yes. Well, okay. I don't know why you stopped after like 10 because <laughs> okay. I thought Have that I Have you used a blender before? A couple of times. <laughs> Okay, so so your own. blender can't defeat, well you swore this could destroy ice, but <laughs> pineapple chunks is, and are defeating hitting it. hitting the liquefy button. Okay, let's shake it. What's let's the shake difference? It. Maybe that'll help. I don't, well, okay, so my options are liquefy, frozen drink, milkshake, smoothie, or ice crush. See, ice, there's an option oh, for we'll ice. Oh, let's see if it does anything. Okay, so which, I'll try frozen drink. Are you sure you've used a blender before? Like now that I think about it, I don't know that I've ever seen you use a blender. Well, it's not something I use in like everyday cooking. But we've been married many years and I've not seen this. I've made like smoothies and stuff. With a stick blender. But that's, I do have a stick blender too. No, I Do you want to put the stick blender. blender in there and then pray that it doesn't Oh God, explode? no. Okay, do you think that is, okay, I think that the consistency looks, I mean the color's not oh, great. Are we really gonna call that Dole Whip? We're gonna try it. It's a little chunky. Okay. Are right, you ready? Not really. Cheers. This, oh boy.
It's still got pineapple texture. And it tastes like coconut. Like I love pineapple, but Dole Whip is not, like pineapple stringy. So this is good, but <laughs> it's nothing like Dole Whip other than the name. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, not at all. It doesn't taste anything like Dole Whip. This is like a pineapple smoothie. If a pineapple smoothie had the consistency of applesauce, <laughs> then yes. <laughs> it does have the consistency. Oh yeah, see there's like a string here. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna give this a C plus. I think this is- Oh, being generous. <laughs> mediocre. I'm gonna best. go with a C minus because I'm not finishing that mess. All right, should we clear, clear off and, and set up for Dole Whip number two? Yes. Okay. All right, we're ready for Dole Whip number two. Are you ready? Not after the first one, no. I'm hoping for some better results because that was not great. So this Dole Whip um, has a couple of extra steps and an extra ingredient, which I'm hoping makes the difference. So again, we have crushed pineapple. This time it doesn't have to be frozen, so we just used cans of crushed pineapple, Cool Whip, uh, lime juice, and sugar, and again, a pinch of salt. Did Whatever you find out means. what pinch meant? No. Okay. No, so we're just, maybe that was the difference with the last recipe. I don't recipe. think you interpreted pinch as this is a wild card for however much I feel like. Well, what is a pinch? I need a unit like this. of measure. Take your finger and go like this. But how do you do that when you're using a grinder? Well, we're the idiots using a grinder for this. <laughs> okay, let's do this. All right. Okay, so we take crushed pineapple and we put it in our blender, so. This is gonna make a giant mess, I guarantee it. Oh boy. Ugh. Oh! oh. <laughs> I did it. Okay. Also got it all over the counter. Uh-huh, all right. Lime juice, which we have measured out here. All right, a tiny bit of lime juice. Um, and sugar. Okay, and now, we blend. Oh, this one's blending. It helps that it's not frozen. Yeah. I don't know what full speed is. Does that look smooth? Oh. And then the last time you gave up pretty quickly. Do you think that's smooth? Does that look smooth? No, that is not smooth. That's still chunky? Oh my gosh. I think your anemic blender needs to run longer than you think. Okay. All these buttons do the same thing. I'm starting to think we don't have a very good blender. Are you saying my $20 blender is not Hold up, what did you the do? top of the line? On the blender. Blender. All the it buttons has many do buttons. the same thing. Yeah, they all blend. What do you think, like, this is the button for the strobe light? Well, they all have different, like, why would you have five buttons? Which one turns on Bluetooth? <laughs> this is not that kind of blender. Okay. Okay, that is not what I want. Have I sufficiently blended? I'm sufficiently bored. It looks pretty smooth. Okay. It all still has a very- No, no, we have to add the Cool Whip. Add, add the whip topping and process until smooth again. Okay, Cool Whip sticks to everything. I'm hoping the Cool Whip makes it creamier. I'm just hoping for anything that doesn't taste like applesauce with coconut in it. <laughs> okay, we're gonna blend some Cool Whip. It's just making awful noise and not blending. We're gonna try a different method called stirring. We're gonna stir it in and see if that makes a difference. And then you're gonna blend it? Yes. Because everything is just sitting on the top. Okay. Either we don't know how to use a blender or we need a new blender. 
Possibly both. <laughs> So this one, that you did pretty good. It's still chunky. Is it? I don't think it's chunky. Is it chunky? Is it smooth on top? I don't know. It's a little lumpy. I don't know. If your blender can't handle pineapple, no, 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 there's another step. This is too complicated. This one. <laughs> All right, so now we have to put it through our ice cream maker. This is already too much work. I could have gone to Florida, gotten Dole Whip, and come back by now. <laughs> okay. Are you out of your mind with this? Let's get our ice cream maker which is also not top of the line, but I've made ice cream. More We've than successfully I made ice cream with this. So I'm hoping this works. Okay. And the ice cream maker is pretty easy because you just pour it in and turn it on. Although I suppose it's also how blenders work. All right. Ooh, that is chunky. <laughs> that was a mistake. Well, let's see what happens if we put in the ice cream maker. Okay. Well, you've made ice cream with like chocolate chips and, and Snickers. Uh huh. And it didn't liquefy, it, did it? Uh, no. Now we wait. How long? 15 minutes. here and we see what disaster we have created. Are you ready? Not really. Not after the first okay. one, no. So this one, it says you could serve with like a splash of pineapple juice. I don't know. There's so much pineapple in this. Oh God. Oh, look how chunky that is. What we need is rum. I don't know how we blew that. I know. We don't have any rum. Darn quarantine. Okay. So Dole Whip is like a soft serve that's really smooth. And this is a lot of chunks. I don't know how to describe that, but it's not good. Maybe it tastes good. It's pineapple and sugar is probably good. Yeah. No, I thought that about the other one and it was not good. The consistency of the other one was like applesauce. With an aftertaste of coconut. Okay, so why don't you scoop us some? It's very soft. Okay. Maybe it'll be velvety. I'm hoping the Cool Whip made a difference. That's so chunky. All right, now we gotta put some Pineapple in there. It's a splash. Okay. You know when I mix it, it's a little smoother. Mix it with the I'm pineapple. not gonna mix it. I'm just gonna start straight. <laughs> All right, here we go. Okay, better. It's Much still better. stringy. Like when I took a bite, I could see the strings from the pineapple on my spoon. If you had a working blender, <laughs> and some rum, mm -hmm. this one could potentially pass as Dole Whip. Yeah. The other recipe does not. I think our blender really held us back. Um, I'm wondering if a food processor would be better. Didn't one of them specify a food processor and you're like, yeah, blender's just as good. <laughs> probably. Yes, I know that's a fact. You, you probably. You know nothing. All right. This one I'm not gonna throw in the garbage. Does this one take you to Adventureland? Not in the Magic slightest, Kingdom? no. You're not sitting in the tiki room with your Dole Whip? No. No? This is good. All right. I don't know that I'd like jump to making this again though. I think we've really like, this is good done a for service me to eat. here. We've done a service and really helped people here with, with our cooking skills. If you'd like food, you could eat. <laughs> Check this recipe out. <gasps> Oh, gonna... wait, we should have fed it to each other. Oh, there you go. So romantic. <laughs> well, this has been fun. Thank you for helping me slaughter Dole Whip. Let's go trick our kids into eating it. <laughs> eating fruit, they'd never. 
We could try. We could dream. <laughs> All right. Good work, wife. Thank you. Good work to you too. I hope you enjoyed making Dole Whip with us today. If you like this video, you can subscribe for more or visit www for more Disney World content. See you guys in the parks. Give it a try. <laughs> wow. Oh, that's sweet. I'm cold. No good? Yeah. It's okay.